Hey Windows fans, it's Mark for Windows Central. In this video, we have an early sneak peek at Hyperlapse Mobile Beta. So we don't know when Microsoft is releasing this application. And since this is still an early beta, we don't even know if the final version is going to look like this. There's a record button on the right side and there's a switch to the front facing camera. Uh, there's also the light button here, which turns on the light on the back. So I'll show you sample footage in a bit, but here's what happens when you tap the record button. The lower left corner is going to show you a timer and uh, right next to that, it's going to show you the length of the hyperlapse at 8x speed. Uh, this is helpful because, for example, if you shoot at 30 second clip and you play it back at two, two times the speed, it's only going to be 15 seconds. And the estimate here at the bottom will explain that to you. So let's just stop this and let me show you a sample footage which I shot earlier today. So that video was shot in Bardo Pell Mansion in the Bronx, New York, in case you were wondering. So after you shoot a, a hyperlapse, uh, you can select uh, the, the speed from 1x all the way to 32x. And uh, once you're happy with that, just tap the save button and it's going to save the hyperlapse. And then from here, you are given three options. You can either share the video, save it at a different speed or capture a new video. So that's an early look at Microsoft's hyperlapse mobile beta. Uh, we look forward to the final version and we think a lot of Windows Phone users are going to like it. That should be it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'm Mark Gwim for Windows Central. Thanks for watching.